For Sparta to win the title, or anything, well, I think that I can speak for everyone in Slavia. So I'll say it openly. We don't want them to win anything. Well remembered fondly, the scepters of Slavia's lone success in 1996 still haunt the club today. The title is generally deemed the preserve of Sparta, and a Slavia win would be almost unimaginable. To win the championship, to win the Czech league, well that would be fantastic. It's been such a long time. I think almost nine, ten years since we managed to do it. So if it happened again, that would be fantastic. And the fans, I just can't imagine what would happen. With both teams still in title contention, the pre-match atmosphere was as frenzied as ever. Slavia fans made the short trip in the hope that they could cause an upset. Be it local pride or simply three points, it might help propel them towards that much sought after title. Sparta fans appeared much more relaxed, knowing their team were the favourites as ever to win this and go on to take another championship. But in the derby, you never know what's going to happen. win for Sparta and an all-important step towards yet another title. Slavia well and truly put in their place. For goal scorer Hova, the feeling is almost indescribable. It's a great feeling because a lot of people are watching the match. In a regular League or Cup game it feels great after you score, but in a derby it's far more special. Definitely when I'm older I'll want to rerun the derby matches and watch those more than the normal games. When we win the derby it's a great feeling, both for us and for our fans because the game against Sparta is such a critical match. They're the enemy, the biggest one Slavia have, so it's brilliant when we beat them. But winning the title becomes almost a side issue when these two go head to head. Despite the standard in domestic Czech football sliding in recent years, the fixture has lost none of its passionate appeal. A derby win still means everything. For the Czech Republic, this is the biggest game in the league because the country divides itself into Sparta and Slavia. Everyone eagerly awaits it. On this occasion, there was not much between the teams, so every point was important. While the stadium was sold out, the football fell a bit short. This time it wasn't a great spectacle, but that can happen in the derby, where it's more about getting a win than playing well. And on this occasion, Sparta won deservedly. And despite the away fans putting on brave faces, there are few worse feelings than losing the derby. The whole city is either Sparta or Slavia. One half will always be in mourning after this game.
Když se prohraje tady tenhle zápas ze Spartu, tohle derby, tak je to něco... It's never a nice feeling when you lose against Sparta. You don't want to go to training. You don't want to leave training once you're there. And you don't want to go out because everyone will have a go at you. It's bad. It feels really awful. Increasingly, the rivalry is becoming a one-horse race. Sparta's dominance since the 80s shows no sign of relenting. 34 championships and counting. For most, there's no question as to which club is the bigger one. Sparta are as big as you can get, for so many reasons. The fans, the stadium, and I don't mean just the stadium, but as far as I'm concerned, we have a prouder history too. I don't want to put Slavia down, but I think Sparta have been a lot more successful. Of course, I've been a part of it and shared those successes, but for me, Sparta's the clear favourite. But Slavia too have one of the proudest histories of any club in Europe. And it's that history that makes this rivalry all the more special. Both teams have suffered adversity, but the derby remains as important as it's always been. It's a matter of history. These are the two biggest teams in the Czech Republic. It goes right back to my grandfather's time. He went to watch Sparta while my wife's grandfather supported Slavia. Whenever they meet outside football, they talk as normal. But whenever there's a derby, they don't phone each other, or they don't talk to each other, even at family dinners. Otherwise, they're fine, but the derby takes it so far that they can't speak to each other.